Hello everyone, Detta here, and well, we're back with Dead Space. We took a trip to uh, Nicole's office. She wasn't there. Some people don't like it, you know, when their significant other drops in at them at work. In on them at work. I can understand that. So she must have ran off some. And that's fine. Let's chase her through this barricaded uh, wall, shall we? A little bit of a boom. That's an engineer for you. Makeshift uh, explosive device, hydrazine, and a uh, shock pad. Probably should back up. Take cover to detonate. Oh, do I need to be like in here? We have run out of body bags. That's not good. That implies, along with all the other messages, that like. The Necromunks were running around a while, while shit wasn't bad yet, you know? I always find that kind of situation interesting. Like, some folk were trying uh, to keep the order going, you know? Oh, wow. That's a lot of drop frame there. Remember, when you it's the morning, time. Find Captain Matthias's body, get his rig codes, and the computer's all ours. Okay. Yeah, Captain, that's who we're looking for. Help me, help me, help me. Sorry. We are fuel. Or full. Can't read. Uh, which direction am I supposed to go? Behind me. I played a video game or two, and I know if the game tells you to go backwards, you go the other way. Security clearance required. I'll F off and screw you. Save me, save me, save us! Guess we have no choice but to go that way. Oh, it's my girlfriend, Nicole! How you doing? Give me a big old hug. Oh, you're not really there. Move and transmit to all personnel. This is Senior Medical Officer Nicole Brennan. Medical is overwhelmed. We need help. Look at his wounds. We can't handle so many trauma cases, and the command crew won't tell us what's happening. Aw, uh, my girlfriend was like a good person trying to help people. Aw. She was here. The heck is this thing? Follow her hologram. She literally ghosted me. <laughs> Let's not look at that horrible body. Report of psychiatric observation. Harris is asleep after another dose of sedative. He seems literally unable to sleep without chemical aid. Most people succumb to exhaustion after more than 50 hours of waking, regardless of circumstances. Not Harris. His bizarre explanation of the events on the colony points to the same paranoia we've seen elsewhere planetside. His guilt is not in doubt. Two security officers were present when he took Dr. Sciarello hostage and murdered Nurse Evans, and Harris doesn't deny his actions, but he shows no remorse. In fact, he insists there was no crime, specifically that Evans wasn't a nurse when he killed her. This is classic sociopathic behavior, but Harris exhibits no other symptoms. He is affable and friendly, able to empathize and offer original opinions. When questioned about Evans' murder, however, he becomes withdrawn and uncommunicative. He claims the explanation is stuck in his mind, that talking about it mixes up its message. He also undergoes intermittent hallucinatory periods, again, similar to those experienced by other colonists. During his long waking periods, Harris exhibits writing behavior on any available surfaces, claiming that dreams need to speak, and that he's attempting to make it whole again. That means I haven't determined yet. Given the complexities of his case, I plan to reach out to my colleagues for more insight. That bit, that last bit, doesn't sound like a sociopathic behavior. I think you're supposed to think that, um... Uh, the nurse and the other person were, um, perhaps, um, necromorphs, but really, think about it. One, why is there a colony here? Why aren't we taking this place apart? And two, um, I completely lost my train of thought. There was others, isn't that what they said? Dear Altman, we are here. Altman. Give me that pulse ammo. I know. I just wanted the pulse ammo. Uh, thank you. 
And computers? What are the no use if they can't understand my intentions? That way, huh? Alright. Uh, no power, though. There's no power, though. There's power here. Uh, we need a power a thing. Power thing. There it is. Power cells. To remove battery, ensure no power is being used by circuit breaker. Uh, Where does that go, though? Before we do that. Ah. Suit upgrade and... Oh, no, these aren't suit upgrade things. Why can't I grip this? Does this have a grip wall? No. Oh, because we need to do it like that. What's this secret room behind the shower? Does anybody know about this? It seems like it should be investigated. Ah, it's the room of whispers. Yes, lots of credits. Yay. Audio log. Medical log. Dr. Nicole. Nicole. Oh, this was Nicole's secret. So much for being paranoid. You know, room to hide away from work. I repurposed this room to run counseling sessions without unitologists interfering. Now it's the only place I feel safe. I recovered a limb after yesterday's attack. Genetically, it's human tissue with bizarre mutations. But it's just a sample. It's not enough to figure out a cure. Where is this sample you're talking about? Wait, where's that report from engineering? That doesn't matter. Can't use yeah. that anyways. The engineers pulled something out of machinery. Limbs missing, torso intact. Okay. Time for a real autopsy. Guys? Ah, babies! Babies don't like it when you turn off the power. Babies? I see you, baby. Baby's a nut daddy. Come on. Baby? Where'd the baby go? Yeah, bro. Take this leg. Take that bit of torso. Did that actually hurt him? I have that arm, thank you very much. Jeez, I'm trying to conserve ammo here. Little monster around here? We got like the scare music still going. Whoa! My girlfriend. Scariest thing of all. Baby contained money. It's highly unusual for a baby. Usually they just cost you money. Oh, that's not good. That's just a bloody hole. Now let's run towards this way, I guess. <gasps> Baby. Baby. Don't Don't ignore me, baby. Whoa, what a leap. You never know who has ammo inside of him. this a little bit. Get quite a bit of ammo, as much as I would like to just spend it. Uh, we got mail? Request retrieved. What? Me. 
I woke in the dark with them scratching in the walls. Scratching like rats. And you were a lot mean with them. Fuck it. I'll cut them out. I'll cut them out. I'll cut them out. Good luck with that. Cutting out, ma'am. That's what I say when I get a hangnail. <laughs> Oh shit. There was a third one. I kinda didn't mean to spam heal there. Can you guys stop? Thank you. Take that. I see this thing is just not good at killing things. I forgot how does the behavior work with heals. Do you use your biggest heal first or your smallest heal? Don't remember. Is there even anything back here? Why is there an O2 canister back here? You should be asking yourself. Ah, uh, do you know what? It's probably just, you know, because you're in a medical place. They always have O2 around. Yeah, that's why. He'll be discreet. I just got the latest report from Aegis 7. The situation's worse than Captain Matthias will admit. Age of seven. Forty percent of the colony's population is now showing symptoms. Depression, hallucinations, more violence. Well, sometimes people have a hard time moving to a new place. I know it's linked to the marker somehow, but I just don't have enough data. Uh, or, sir, gotta wait for this to finish before we see. Oh, are you getting it out? By any means possible. That patient, Brent Harris, might be our last hope. <laughs> Hi. Have you seen Nicole somewhere? Oh, no, don't. No, don't. I guess you finally got it out, huh? Your system, that is? Okay. Oh, jeez. I don't want to look at that. Scan rig to unlock workstation. Who busted out of here? That's not good. Let's make a save, shall we? Okay, to the morgue. Where the bodies stay dead. Yeah! Thank God, I got this. Jesus. That was spooky. Babies. Babies behind me? No babies behind me, just in front of me. Ow. Baby. Baby's tough. Can I throw this in there? That'd be cool if I could. Video game. Let the rule of cool reign supreme, huh? Two again, huh? Why is the morgue so spooky? Usually, the only doing person doing whispers here in the morgue are the people. The morgue, the morgue person. The morgue. Oh god, what's the morgue person called? <laughs> what's the name? Mortician? No, that's not right. What the heck? That bit of knowledge has just escaped my brain. Whatever those people are called. <laughs> those people. It's my unfortunate duty 
the medical examiner. Uh-huh. Uh, the officially pronounced Captain uh, Benjamin Matthias dead. Reports of the exact circumstances surrounding his death are conflicted and will be left for investigators to determine one, uh, once we return to port. I will constrain my comments to the condition of the body. Subject is in general good health for his age, though a cursory blood test indicates his leukocyte count was very low, with eosinophils in particular almost non existent. His pre flight physical exam showed no such problems, indicating rapid onset, but it does not appear to have had any effect on his death. Uh, multiple contusions on the arms and hands indicate a brief struggle pre mortem. Light contusions around the rib cage indicate he was restrained, so likely for a brief period. Cause of death was single prolonged trauma to the ocular body, which continued on through the cavity wall and into the frontal lobe, causing rapid neurotrauma, seizure, and death. The angle of penetration of the ocular cavity indicates the injury was not self inflicted. Examination requires the removal of the object to confirm cause of death, but it has been preserved for the investigation to study. Therefore, I will have. No alternative but to record a preliminary verdict of unnatural death. Whether deliberate or accidental is beyond my jurisdiction. Someone stabbed him in his eye till he died. With an object that he did not feel like describing. But we are in cutscene mode. Captain, we're not going to need this anymore. Uh, hey, excuse me. Uh, you can have the body once I'm done. Came here to finish the job, did you? Oh no. Ooh, that cloth tearing. Oh my god, that's amazing looking. Sir, I I have a girlfriend already. Ow, ow. Uh. Captain! He has no head no more. Oh boy. Oh, he's doing it to people outside too. Captain, don't make me switch guns on you. I don't have a lot of ammo. Captain only had 400 bucks on him. You think the captain would be richer? Ooh! Whoa! He's fresh, he's fast, he wants a piece of my ass. I don't think so. Oh, he, oh, he got me a post, post-living stab. What the heck? Okay, where's this flying fuck? Stop making dudes. Oh, boy. Uh, I did not mean to hit C. I meant to do that. hell did I say there? <laughs> uh, just, I don't know. Um, Alright. Sorry about your fate, Captain, but I'll take your rig now. Thank you very much. Isaac, what's your status? Do you have the Captain's rig? Fuck me! Ugh. Transmitting codes now. I saw it, Hammond. A flying one turned the Captain's body into a, another one of those things. The same must have happened to Chen. God, maybe the command computer has something. Uh, where's Daniels when you need her? Head back to the security check. Where is Daniels when you need her? At least I can upgrade your clearance. I can reach level one securities. Isn't that nice? If only I remembered all the other level ones that I ran into on the way here. Secure clearance has increased. Higher clearance doors and unlockers are now accessible. Oh. Maximum load. Do not exceed. Isaac, I'm here. The computer, the elevator here is telling me I gained weight. The is oh no, it's eight, working. Oh, God. I thought it wasn't working. Never mind. There's no time. That tram station's offline. Unless. Here. Head back to the flight deck. I'll guide you from there. If this damage report's right, there's a shortcut to engineering. Okay. 
Wasn't there stuff in there? Yes, there was. You know what? Let's take a look real quick. Level 2 clearance, never mind. I was going to say, maybe it shows on the map. Um, level 2. So level 2 doors show up on the map. Do level lockers show up on the map? Mm, probably not. Why was this room locked? Just It just is. Just is. Hmm. Go double check real quick. I feel like I'm forgetting something. What was that tissue sample thing about? Um. Oh, I need to turn this back on, don't I? Boop, boop, boop. Turn that on. Confused about what door I need to go into, apparently. Clearance confirmed. Yeah. Oh, 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 open up. Oh, thank you very much. Die. All this shit is locked. But we coming back here. This door is locked. It'll probably unlock when we come back for all of that. So, let's not worry too much about it right now. Let's just keep going. But first, it's always time for shopping. Ooh, look at all that money. Look at all that money. So. Um. Plasma cut upgrade. Bring this part to the bench to extend the upgrade path. Oh, okay, sure. You know, I need to buy plasma ammo soon, aren't I? Um, I'm not going to buy a node right now because whenever I get to another shop, there'll be a node, so I don't need to worry about it. I am going to make a save, though. Any of these lockers locked? Level 2. Okay, good. That's a good example to look. Yeah, so lockers aren't on here as locked, but doors are. Bit of a bummer. Alright, let's go. Uh, I thought he said the tram wasn't working. Am I crazy? Is that not what he said? Eh, whatever. There we go. Hangar cargo tram control. Hangar cargo tram control. Now arriving at flight deck tram controls. That's pretty smooth. Pretty smooth, smooth traveling. Ah, uh, yeah, horror door. Uh, okay. This is uh. Bench. 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 Take my plasma cutter upgrade so I don't need to carry that in my inventory, please. And I got a I got a note out of that. Cool. Um Greatly increases ammo capacity. I should probably go straight for that, shouldn't I? Um, two, one capacity, one reload. Generally happy with the capacity. Special two. But that implies the existence of a special one. It only gave me, what, like four more? Alright. 
Oh, should I min-max that and wait till like my ammo is like empty? Probably should have. It's going here, right? Okay. What is this? Nuka Cola vending machine? Ah, uh, our first area. Nice to be back. Light lounge. Security reporting retrieved. What do you mean? Whoa, what the heck? Oh, hologram. Oh yeah, that's what happened to Chad, yeah. Okay, thanks for telling me. I was here. I saw it. I'm surprised they didn't show any of the other people. Security check it. Where are we going? Down this long ass hallway. Okay. Okay. The damage report says there's a broken cargo lift just beyond the hangar doors. I'll open them now. Please don't. Zero gravity. You'll need your thrusters to reach it, but that lift shaft should take you straight down to engineering. A pretty impressive transition to an area if you think about it. Chapter 2 Intensive Care completed. I don't remember this game being so grand. I'm going to be honest with you, in the original. Like, that's impressive. Did they change things, really, or not? Am I just forgotful? Or am I just forgotful? Yeah, that's words. I mean, it's perhaps. Perhaps I just don't remember. It was a very long time ago I played this. Something down here, wasn't there? Yep. No, not that. Oh, that's a power core. We might need that somewhere. Give me. Shit, not. Damn it. I don't. kind of don't like how those buttons are. Two button holes. You know what I mean? Costing me shit. It's gonna matter eventually. Get on in there, please. I don't know what that powered, but. This door. I mean, none of this is where we need to go. We need to go out the front. Can't hurt to look around the hangar bay, though. Found to be a goodie or two. Or, like, seven in here? Jeez. Level three security clearance. They have nothing in it? I forgot I can do that. No, it had something. I'm not crazy. Alright. Kind of want a healing to replace that one I just lost. I know we haven't really been in, in like, a, like threatened yet, but I feel like shit's about to hit the fan. I don't take the plasma ammo, though. Okay, I think we cleared out this little bit. Can switch to power and see what's over there. I have slid back in my chair pretty far from the microphone. What the heck? Did 
turn that on. You're switching, you're trying though. Oh, that thing is moving. Oh, it's down below, not up ahead, above. Not again with the... <sighs> Can I change this? Um... God, this menu is a pain to move around in. Where is... Can he just grab his F? But only when I'm looking... When I'm right-clicking. Okay. Can I just change that to... Something else. Mouse, mouse one. That's like mouse five. What the heck? <clears throat> okay. And then um, stasis. Well, stasis to mouse two apparently. Oh, save changes. Okay. What I don't want is me to have to right click and take it to do it. That's what I. Eh, whatever. I don't know what moving those uh, tracks gets me, but I did it. Is this one movable? This one's like on a sled. Stop fooling around and just go where the game wants me to go. It's on the side where my ship exploded. Her name's his body is in here somewhere. And it's kind of a bummer. Our little ship was pretty big. For just four people to, to be on it. How do we get in there? There's stuff in there. I want that stuff. to say. Trigger Link. Over 50 years of experience providing the best aftermarket upgrades. Offering reliable firing, sustained use, and reset. Happy to know that they uh, practice uh, good trigger advertising? I don't know. Why do they need so much guns on a ship that um you know, purpose was to break up planets apart. One more box to break before we head out, I guess. Two more boxes, never mind.
Well, ain't that like a zero G, or not zero G, but like a wall blocking air thing? Can't breathe no more. Can't hear anything no more. There's an O2 station over here. That's nice. Here's to be the way I need to go, so. Babies. Two of yous. Silent babies. Dead? He dead. Anybody else want a piece of me? Boogie music, man. Let me reorientate myself here. I got an error. That's not good. What the heck is going on? Please, oh, two, thank you. There's just one here? I thought there was two. Well, that's not good. We about to die. Yeah, this is gonna take too long to uh, pressurize. Exiting zero gravity. Holy crap, can we make it any closer than that? I don't think so. Ooh. Check out this storage hall. We are not punished for our sins. Die by them. Huh? But, no, we not punished for our sins, but by them. So, I can read. Why is this beauty music going off? They're really just hoping for a safe station. <laughs> Hundred bucks, that's it. That's not money. Okay, spooky music. There's someone out here. Ooh, hog. What do we got? Ah, uh, Carol Danvers, Organic Growth and Engineering. Adding this to my maintenance priority request. Maybe something in writing will make them pay attention. That you unidentified growth reported elsewhere on a ship has reached engineering. Not even medical knows what the hell this stuff is. It looks like someone threw their guts up all over the walls and smells about the same. It's spreading faster than we can cut it up, which is pretty disgusting in itself. It's already busted the cargo lift, and it's getting into the engine spoke. We can't find a way to stop it soon. It'll be all over the main engine chamber by the day after tomorrow. Meantime, heading to the mining deck. They've got PFM 100s in storage for ice mining, and they can spare the fuel. Maybe cauterizing this stuff will do the trick. Just hope it doesn't smell worse when it's on fire. Willing to bet it does. So, we got some gross organic growth, huh? That's bad, right? That the ship is telling everyone aboard that. You know? Telling everyone aboard that the ship is about to freaking, you know, collapse. Not collapse, but crash. Uh, anyways, we made it to like a little safe hub area, which means we're gonna be stopping folks. Uh, we made it through a little bit. Now it's time to stop. Hope you all enjoying the series. If you are, please subscribe. Daily uploads on this channel. New video every day, 3 p.m. Eastern time. Alternating let's plays, though. So if you want to catch more of this, it'll be day for next. In the meantime, I'm playing something else tomorrow. Come back tomorrow to check it out. Um, that's it for me today. Hope you all enjoyed. Hope to see you all soon. All right. All right. Um, bye-bye now.